Okay, ready? Yeah. In five, four, three, two, one. Let the celebration begin! Woo! Woo! <laughs> oh. Hey! 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 Stop for the settle down, Jingles. Jingles, what exactly are we celebrating? I thought you knew. Hi, I'm Brandon. And I'm John. And this is the So and So Show, brought to you as always by, who's our sponsor? We don't have one. We don't have one. So Brandon, let me. I'd like to ask you a question. How do you remember things? Um, how do you mean? Yeah, yeah, you've got, a, you've got a better memory than I do. What do you do? Do you write things down in a journal? Do you put oh. strings on your fingers? Or, or do you use post-it notes? No, I don't do any of those things, but I do take a lot of pictures. Really? Yeah, you know they say that a picture is worth a thousand words. I have heard that. So sometimes I use uh, pictures to help me remember things. Like, do you remember, you remember that time we threw a party in your basement? Here, check this out. Uh, yeah, that was five minutes ago. Yeah, and I remember it like it was yesterday, it, thanks to that picture. It was five minutes ago. So how, how about this one? What is that? That's when I visited the world's largest apple orchard in Hampton Falls, New Hampshire. So That is a huge apple! I know. Oh, and you remember that time that I got turned into a giant and then held you in the palm of my hand? <laughs> that never happened. Sure it did. Show the picture. How did I forget that? You were a giant? Mm, the picture proves it. It looks like you're gonna bite me. Come on, John, aren't you over that by now? Come you were a giant. Relax. Now, I, I, oh, hey, you remember that time that we went to uh, Mount Everest? Huh? The, oh gosh, we were so cold. I really don't. Yeah. You should take more pictures. Apparently. Mm. Wow. So uh, that's how I remember things. What works for you? Oh, um, well, I use mnemonic devices. Oh, oh, I, I know exactly what that is, but maybe you can explain it to our viewers. <laughs> you know, it's, it's like coming up with a word or a phrase that helps you remember something, mm -hmm. like uh, every good boy deserves fudge oh, for right. the notes on a music staff, yeah, yeah, yeah. which is E, G, B, D, F. That's right. So it's also like homes. That's how I remember the Great Lakes. Uh, H-O-M-E-S, oh, yeah. Huron, Ontario, Michigan, Erie, and uh, the one that starts with S. <laughs> yes, this works every time. Yeah, that's great. So what do you use mnemonic devices for? Well, let's see if you can guess, Brandon. Ooh. And now it's time for John Makes Brandon Guess Mnemonic Devices. Okay, I'll tell you the mnemonic device I use, and you tell me what you think it helps me remember. Sounds easy. All right, this is great. Okay, here's the first one. Yeah. Gavin enjoys laughing night and day. Gavin enjoys laughing night and day. Yes, right. That's G, mm -hmm. E, L, N, and D. Mm -hmm. That's, that's all I get to go on? Yeah. Like, can I get a hint Okay, I'll give you this a hint. It, it has something to do with the Bible in some way. Okay, okay. Is it the first five books in the Bible? Genesis, Exodus, Leviticus, Numbers, Deuteronomy? That's yes. it! Gavin enjoys laughing night and day, yeah. That's it, you got it. That's great, that's Ooh, great. That's good, this okay. is fun. Hit me okay, another. Okay, okay, okay. This next one has uh, outer space in it, okay? All right, outer. My very excellent mother just served us Newtons. Oh, Newtons are the best. Yeah, I like them. I like yeah. them without the fig, though. Uh, let's see, my very excellent mother, what was it? Just served Just us Newtons. Just served us Newtons. Okay, so that's eight. You said it was outer space related? Mm-hmm. Eight is gotta be, it's gotta be the eight planets of the solar system, isn't uh, it? Yeah, Mercury, Venus, E... Earth. Earth, duh. Okay, <laughs> uh, Mars, Jupiter, Saturn, Uranus, Neptune. Yes, it's handy, oh, isn't it? That works, Yeah, it? it works really well. Okay, well now it's Bible story time with Kellen. Okay, don't tell me. Okay, it's Bible story time with Kellen. I-B-S-T-W-K. Is it like the president? Like maybe the first six? No, presidents? no, 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 no. It's Bible story time with Kellen. Oh, oh Baskin Robbins flavors? No, there's 31. What up, everybody? <laughs> Where's the party at? No party, Kellen, it's just us. Knights of the Round Table. Let's move on. Oh, 
Well, in that case, who's up for some biblical knowledge? We are! Well, today's lesson comes from the book of Psalms. Oh, and a psalm is... Oh, hey, ask Sari. Oh, yeah. <clears throat> Sari. Hola, Senor Juan. Did you change the language on my phone again? Maybe. <clears throat> What's a psalm? Un momento, por favor. Un salmo es un canto sagrado de alabanza o adoración a Dios. Can you translate that into English? Sí, Senor Juan. Oh, uh, a psalm is a sacred song of praise and worship to God. Thanks, Siri. No hay problema, señor Juan. So a psalm is a song, right, Kellen? You got it. And this one is Psalm number 100. It says, shout for joy to the Lord. Kellen? Uh, yes. Yeah, I mean, wrong? a psalm is a song, you said, so shouldn't you be singing? I, yeah, no, I'm oh, not going to sing Oh, Brandon's it. right, Kellen. Brandon's right. We need the full psalm experience, so sing it. Sing it, sing it, sing it, sing it! Okay, okay, okay. How about this? I'll tell you what. I'm not much of a singer, but I know someone who is. They can sing it. Fair enough? Deal. Awesome. Take it away, Louisa. Hey, Kellen, I'm sorry to interrupt. Uh, what's up? Opera's not really my thing. Can you change the station? Sure, I guess so. Uh, how's this? Know that the Lord is God. He made us, we belong to Him. We are His people. We are the Kellen, sheep to His fold. Something less loud, please. All right, you asked for it. Give thanks as you enter the gates of his temple. Give thanks as you enter its courtyards. Give thanks to him and praise uh, bring his back name. The, guitar. the Lord is good. Myself. The Lord is good. This faithful will continue forever. It will last for all time. To come. So, as you can see, there's a lot of different ways you can give thanks to God. You don't even have to be able to sing to celebrate what God has done. But it is important to remember that the Lord is good. His love is faithful and will last forever. Thanks, Kellen. We'll try to remember that. You do that. See you next time, guys. I know. I will take a picture. Oh, yeah. All right. <laughs> that way, now, whenever I, I look at this picture, I'll remember the Lord is good. Oh. Hey, you should come up with a mnemonic device to help you remember. Yeah, why don't I just remember that the Lord is good? I'll help you. The Lord is good, T-L-I-G. Timmy loves intense gophers. That's not good. Uh, tickling lions invites growling. Yeah, it shouldn't be too hard to remember that the Lord is good because he's done so much for us. Yeah. Oh, which brings us to today's question. Ooh. Reveal the question. Oh, that's great. Here we go. What are you grateful for? Think about that. Talk about it with your friends. And remember, tangerine loaves increases gas. The Lord is good. It works. Yeah, hey. You know what? Since the Lord is good. I think good, I see where you're going. What? You want the party to be back on? I think the party's back on. Ah. It's time to celebrate. Let's begin. Ah. Whoa. Ah. Ah. Hey, thank you so much. We'll see you next time on the Soul Show Show, everybody. Ah. Hey, Jingles. Ah. 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 Tips live in Gogurt. <laughs> Tarantulas live in Guam. 
That's not bad. That's a good one. Is, yeah. it, is it also true? Uh, I don't know. Uh, ten lepers in gravy. <laughs> <laughs> That's not. That's not. I don't know.